This is one minute ultrasound for the IVC measurement with respiratory variation. We'll start with the patient in the supine position. The probe will be just to the right of midline on the patient's mid epigastric region, and the probe marker will be pointed towards the patient's head. Using the liver as the acoustic window, I will scan through the right upper quadrant looking for the IVC and pointing up into the chest so that I can see the IVC dumping into the right atrium. Using M mode, I'll place the ice pick through the proximal IVC 2 to 3 centimeters from the heart border or just distal to the first hepatic vein. M mode will then allow me to measure the change in respiratory variation of the IVC. If the patient's breathing spontaneously, I can either wait for them to take a breath normally or I can ask them to sniff in with a forced inspiration. First, I'll measure the inspiration portion of the IVC, and then I'll measure the expiratory portion of the IVC. A quick and dirty standard is that if the IVC collapses greater than 50%, the patient is likely to be volume responsive. The image on the left shows a patient who is volume overloaded. See how the IVC doesn't change with respiration? The image on the right shows a patient who is hypovolemic. Note how the IVC collapses in on itself and is obliterated by inspiration.